FEMA IS HELPING IN NORTH CAROLINA THIS MORNING IN THE DEADLY AFTERMATH OF HURRICANE MATTHEW. CREWS FROM AS FAR AS PENNSYLVANIA AND MISSOURI HAVE GONE TO LUMBERTON. TWO NEWS REPORTER KELLY KING BRINGS US THIS DEVELOPING STORY AND WALKS US THROUGH WHAT THEY'RE DOING TO HELP PEOPLE TRAPPED. EMERGENCY CREWS SAY THEY'RE TRYING TO SAVE SOME 1,500 FLOOD VICTIMS STRANDED BY RISING WATERS. RESCUE TEAMS ARE USING HELICOPTERS AND BOATS TO REACH PEOPLE ON THEIR ROOFS. The FAA has suspended flights in the area so choppers can go in and rescue those people. Eleven in North Carolina have died because of Hurricane Matthew. More than 3,000 are in shelters, and 26,000 people in one county don't have water, and many others are left without power. It's, it's a major uh, historical storm that's going to take some time to repair. So many trees down, there's flooded areas that we can't even get to yet. And that's preventing us from being able to quickly restore some outages. Matthew dumped more than 13 trillion gallons of water on the southeast. The damage is estimated to cost up to $6 billion. Kelly King, 2 News Today, working for you.